One awesome layer to animate is lights, and that also means emission things going around, floating around the scene from a different camera angle. This robot just fell down, and that's a nice shot to also pick up. Maybe I'll add that in later. Going to frame 90, selecting the light, and under its attribute for intensity, right click, set key. And now you see the key popped into the timeline. Going to frame 120, two seconds later, typing in a new value, going to try 0.3. And if that's a little too dark, 0.4. Because auto keyframe was on and the first keyframe was set, because I set the key by right clicking and using set key for a field. If you don't want that anymore, you would right click and break connection and that will break the connection and remove your keys. Here's the scene and across two seconds, it will play out like this. Going to pop back into the viewport renderer, saving that. Next part is to create this little ball that will also animate around the scene. And I'm gonna do that really quickly. I have my camera locked going to jump to a perspective viewport create us create an object wherever object you want this will be emitting light in a moment from now and it's just going to pop into the scene right click assign new material going for arnold ai standard surface skipping over the speckler for a moment going down to emission Pick the color there. Maybe it's red, red or blue, whatever you want. And increase the amount of mission. Jump back to Arnold's renderer and let's switch to the camera view. For the sphere itself, using light linking, I'm gonna disconnect the ability for this object to get light, so relationship editors, light linking, and object centric or light centric. Let me do object centric. And of course, naming files will definitely help. I removed any light from being part of this object. That way, you get rid of that white glow that was happening on, on it. Go back to the main line scene. Let's take a look at it right here. That's looking nice. And this is an example of animating a light in scene when it's just, it could be a point light. It could be an object like this. Let me put it below. So this way in earlier moments, you're not going to see it. And then by frame 120, say it waits a beat to 130. Place the first keyframe by frame 150. This light appears in the scene. and just flies off. This went over animating lights and also animating objects, which can act as a light in the scene and using light linking to include and exclude objects from getting lights. Hope you enjoy and have fun animating.